In 1943, Rosie the Riveter was the star of a campaign recruiting females into defense industries during World War II, becoming an iconic symbol of the working woman. In 1965, Mary Kenneth Keller was the first U.S. woman to earn a Ph.D. in computer science and later helped develop the basic programming language. In 2010, inspired by these feminist STEM icons, Team 3504 Girls of Steel was founded, becoming Pittsburgh's first all-female first robotics team. From day one, our mission was clear, to empower everyone, especially women and girls, to believe that they are capable of success in STEM. Through our unique team structure, placing every member onto both a technical and business subteam, as well as our new inclusion subteams initiatives, all Girls of Steel members are developed into strong and confident leaders. In 2013, we developed our Chassis Project, an outreach initiative where community members can build and drive a fully functioning robot. Since its founding, we've used the Chassis Project at almost 70 outreach events. In 2013, we established Feiyua, a two-week summer camp for Chinese and Taiwanese students in which they design and build a complete FRC robot, then compete with it at an off-season event. In total, over 170 students have attended the camp and multiple overseas FRC teams have been formed as a result. Our team's program pyramid was founded in 2014 and now includes nine FLL junior teams, four FLL teams, and three FDC teams. This system provides the opportunity for our members to directly run and mentor other FIRST teams and creates a sustainable pipeline of STEM passionate students that feeds into our own team. We use political advocacy to encourage more awareness and funding for STEM education. We've gained the attention of political figures including Hillary Clinton in 2016 and Ivanka Trump in 2018. As we reflect on our 10th anniversary, we're proud of the changes we've sparked both in Pittsburgh and around the world. In the words of Rosie the Riveter, we can do it. <laughs>